All right, see that nice little stack of dimes right there? That's why I love the TIG. So nice, doesn't make any spatter. So what I'm gonna do today is just kind of show you a few little ways to get your torch set up. Now, this is your tungsten. The electricity is gonna go through, melt the metal, and then you're gonna dip in your rod. Get your cup, which has the shielding gas. For this, we're gonna be using argon. And put this out to a distance that you like. Now, I use something like that if I'm going to be doing an inside corner weld. You're going to do it shorter if you do an outside corner weld because what you're trying to do is keep that shielding gas around the steel or aluminum in order to keep it from oxidizing. Now, come down to the bottom. I'm going to show you kind of a way to get set up. Now, usually about 85 degrees is a good angle for your torch head. Keep your tungsten as close to the metal as you can, right about a sixteenth of an inch. Take your filler rod right about 15 degrees. Move it along, dip in, slowly going along. Next thing you know, watch out, you're making stack of dimes on your own. So get out there, get a Lincoln Precision TIG 225, start welding, and make yourself your own little stack of beads. This tip is brought to you by Lincoln Electric, the welding experts.